sorry for the woodpecker interrupting there, but you'll see we've got a little monarch baby kind of in the middle of the screen there. We've got one on the top left, top right. There's an egg you see in the top middle there. I'm not sure where the egg is, was on that leaf right underneath the egg. And the one curled up against the monarch in the middle, I'm not sure. And I think that's a monarch there on the right, but I'm having a hard time seeing. And then there was an egg kind of, hello Mr. Woodpecker, um, on the flower there last night, but I'm not seeing it now. So I'm gonna have to do a little, a little investigating at lunch, but I'm gonna let them finish opening and enjoy the morning. Yay! All right, so doing a, another follow-up. So I've got one right there. There's one trying to climb up there. I'm gonna change the milkweed out and clean up their frost. You can see some of their frost, little bitty bits right there. I'm, I'm hoping they didn't like escape out here in my Brookshire's ad, um, but they could have. And I put the rock in because I didn't want this tent to blow away. So I'm going to inspect oh, the eighth one hatched. Um, so I've got eight in here. Uh, we'll see. We'll see what happens. So I cleaned up their frass in their bowl here. And I had to go through and find all of them. It took me a while. So you can see two there. There's two on this leaf. One here. One here. And then one is trying to escape over here. Um, I'm going to see if I can get it on a leaf and move it back so it doesn't get too lost. But they're so little, they're very hard to find. I thought I was going to lose one of them. So I'm going to go get some more milkweed and um, leaves. And uh, hopefully they'll be a little more satisfied. Update number three is I toted the caterpillars to my parents' house this weekend. Um, Uh-oh. Is that? I don't know. So update number three is that I toted the, the monarchs to my parents this weekend and I didn't bring extra milkweed because I thought, hey, my mom has tropical milkweed, no big deal. But I didn't think to think that my dad sprays for mosquitoes. <laughs> so I checked what he sprayed and it was definitely not something that I can necessarily trust being safe even though it's been a couple weeks, uh, the bottle just made me leery. So then I had to track down wild milkweed, which, which places I knew it used to be is not there anymore because there's no houses on it. So I ended up finding some green milkweed in a lot uh, in East Fort Worth. So they're gonna have some green milkweed. Also, I only count six and not eight. I don't know where the other two went. I'm hoping I didn't lose them when I was cleaning the cage out yesterday. Alright, here's another update. So as you see I've got some floral tubes. I need to add some more water. Um, now I'm down to five. This little one whoop, right there. It's kind of hard to see because it's not focusing. Um, died. It died. You can tell it died. It's still in the same place it was last night. So it's kind of a bummer. So I've got five. One down there. This fatty fatty right here. Um, there's another one hiding under there, and I've got two right there. Um, I definitely like these floral tubes. It seems like it's a lot better of a way to go. Um, anyway, kind of sad, but that's where we're at right now. Down to five. So update number four, I think. Um, so I rotated the cage so I could put a couple plants in, um, and as you see we got that one there, one right there, I know the focus isn't good, um, there's a third right there, there, well it's trying to focus, there you go, there's a little bit better, um, so that's four, um, but yeah, three. There's five in here. Oh yeah, there's another one right there. And then um, another chompy down here in the floral tube. Um, give them some space. And I didn't know that this is um, 
like styrofoam. I didn't know if that was going to bother them, and they fell, so I put some rags in there in case they fell off. Um, so I got five. They're doing good. Um, hope to find more eggs soon. All right, so I've got one pupa, which happened last night. I've got three fat caterpillars right there, and a fourth down there. Um, which they all look like they're going to go pupate soon, too. So, um, they're doing pretty good. I've got another plant in the cage as well. Um, I've also got to keep this little guy off. And, um, might have some more chrysalises soon. It's exciting. Alright, quick video. It's raining. Um, so this one's been in this J-shape to uh, pupate for the morning. I kind of thought it would be further along than it was. Um, we've got one up here still, still trying to eat. Um, got another one right here still trying to eat. It's kind of hard to see. I didn't want to open it up. Um, I had to move that one because as you see, a caterpillar came through and chowed. The leaf so I had to improvise so I'm hoping hoping that leaf stays okay for the next 12 days um, so there's three oh there's this guy he does not know what he's doing he was by the zipper of the entrance and I had to move him and he was on the stem and now it looks like he's I don't know he looks he wants to go pupate I think all right so I'm gonna do one last video of the caterpillars because as you see that one and that one and that one in the corner are all ready to pupate. It took them forever to find a good place um, that they were happy with. Um, they were all piled up over here in the corner on on the zipper which <laughs> drove me crazy and that one right there um, just really 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 wanted to be in that corner. I moved it like tw two or three times over off the zipper and it finally found a good spot, as you see. I can live with that. <laughs> um, that one's gonna hang from the roof, and that one found a leaf, so. Um, and we got that chrysalis, and we still have that one right down there. So, we'll see, we'll see. Kind of weird to think they're gonna be butterflies next time I see them. They're in the chrysalis, bud. All right, so it's been eight days Can since that one. Are those plants out there? Yes. It's been eight days since uh, this one on the right went to chrysalis, but I started noticing yesterday that it was starting to get darker. And it's actually even gotten more, more wings showing than they were um, an hour, hour and a half ago when I got home from work. So I'm kind of interested to see, I don't know how fast this happens, if it's going to be like tomorrow, Wednesday, um, pretty exciting. The one on the left should be the second one, so maybe midweek this week uh, we'll see some changes on that one too. Pretty cool though. Butterfly. I did! Yeah. I did! It did turn into a butterfly, didn't it? Uh-huh. She's going to dry, or I think it's a hem. Got to dry his wings out. Uh. Yeah, and I'll release it in a little, little while at lunch. That's mm. exciting. Someone's ready to go, so we're gonna go and release. It's probably gonna fly right out. We got this one, which looks like it's a female. So yay! And this one. His wings haven't quite opened yet, so I can't tell if it's a female or not. But um, the one, the two on the top, it's really hard to tell with this angle, guys. 
uh, look like they're going to open as well soon. Yay, we got two butterflies. And no two butterflies come up. Yeah. So we have all four have hatched this morning. Uh, the two on the top of the <laughs> canopy there um, were not out this morning when I left for work, so like 7.30. Um, and then I had one here on this leaf, and oh, the other one on the stick down here, they were out. The one on the leaf had just emerged probably 10, 20 minutes before I'd gotten out here this morning. Um, and I was trying to hopefully leave two, the ones that hadn't emerged, um, from for Forrest to, to play with, not to play with, to see it go, but they all look like they're ready to go. So I think I'm going to just let them all out. And uh, we'll have to let him experience that another time, unless they're not interested in leaving. So, but I think they are. So I'm going to unzip and let these guys out because they are happy. Oops, there. There they are. <laughs> Pretty exciting. Okay, guys. See ya. Good luck. See ya. You guys want to go? Can't decide?